Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Soul and the Pokemon Shield. Let's play with your least favorite idiot, me. And today's episode, we're going to be going to, uh, go see the ancient moor on the cliffside. But first, I'm going to show you my new team. So I decided that I don't want to use my starter because I don't like it. And I decided just to change my team a little bit. So, I just want to show you what I did off screen. So we have Dill Marker, and I got this off from the trade. And I bred it, so I don't have the ESP boost. And, yeah. I learned that this thing evolves by an ice stone by accident when I was going through my items. And not level 39 or 40, one of those two. Uh, so, when it reaches that level, I will evolve it because Darmantan is a powerhouse of a Pokemon. Unless they, like, did something stupid. Hopefully they didn't. Then we have Orbeetle, which was already on our team. Fantastic Pokemon, I want to keep using it. Then we have this thing. And if you don't know what this is... Galalan Yamask evolves into this. This recent, um, gets rid of Galalan, oh, yeah, Galalan, uh, Carpharigus completely, and it's a new form. Rinnerigus, it's a new form. It's ghost ground, like its previous form. And to get this, it's kind of weird. You have to be at, like, low HP, so in the red, I guess, and go to a certain location, and it will evolve. And my friend told me this when I told her I really want to use it, so that's kind of... I would have learned about it anyway, so I'm happy he did. And then we have Milk Ringer, which when I get, uh, I believe it's either green or blue, and it turns nighttime, I will evolve into the Rainbow Spore Shrill, which I want, and it's still a level, so it's only going to be on my team. And then we have two members of our team. We have Bortend, because I don't want to get rid of it yet. I don't know if my team's going to be good enough, because I don't EV train, I just use ESP candies. So it's going to be on my team for a little bit, and then we have Simon just because when it evolves, I'll be like, okay, you can get off my um, off my team now. So, yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, that's all. Ow, my hand. I need to get a proper shock mount for my mic. Um, I have actually have not recorded in like a week. Actually, less than a week. Like five days. <laughs> I want to get to competitive. Oh, Sonya's here, but she's not stopping us. Fantastic. What's going on up there? Well, why don't you check yourself? Sudden big noises are a great way to get people feeling uneasy. What, what's going on? What's happening at the ruins? Well, wouldn't it be nice to know if you could move your camera up? I've seen you before. Are you a gym challenger? Of course. Oh, also, look at me. I look fantastic. I've, I found these shades. And I love this. Wait, what? Is this like the... It's not going to be the elephant Pokemon we saw that they accidentally revealed beforehand. Um, when, like, everyone wants to see the silhouette when they come out of Pokeball. Is this the evolution for that? It looks cool from the backside, but I need to see what it looks like from the front. Destroy it! Destroy all! We're gonna find those vision stars! Wait, BD? Wait, that's not the- Bede? Whoever? Whatever? That's not a good idea. That's, maybe destroying, um, ancient mirrors isn't the proper way to get vision stars. I have 20 of them, you can take them. We've got to bring the chillman more vision stars if we're gonna police them. What is- Oh, I, okay. Maybe I don't like it as much. I don't like it- I like his design, I don't- At the same time. It's kind of, kind of weird, kind of weird. Cobalt Jaw. Is that actually, uh, the name of the Pokemon? Weird. Um, if you're truly the chairman's Pokemon, then you should feel grateful for this chance to help him find wishing stars. Oh, because- the, So this is definitely the Pokemon that- The Pokemon the guy had at the beginning. I forgot they showed it, actually. Um, I actually forgot that Pokemon exist. And we just moved five steps and then it gets into a cutscene. I wanted to talk to Sonya, but... Oh my, you again. So you think you can start collecting Rich Stars now that you have the Chairman's favor? That's the way of... Um, that's the way of things, is it? I see, you have um, you have some cunning in you. But I won't have it. I won't allow anyone to stand in my way. Wait, 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 wait. I came here to stop you from breaking the mill. No, I don't care about Vision Stones. They're useless. I can get them for like 100 watts by someone. Oh, this is the scene. This is the scene they had in the trailer when we originally saw BD. So that's fantastic. Okay. Uh, we have Bite. Yeah, Bite should be good enough. Also, I need to actually just do this. Okay. It's going good. I hope. Um, I wasn't like on my capture card, but uh, hmm. I've seen more than enough to judge your team's abilities. What are you going to send out? Wait, is that his only Pokemon? Oh, that'd be fantastic. I've seen enough. <laughs> just, just, 
just in the battle here. Okay, so we're on par. I thought I was gonna be over leveled at all. Nope. I was still had like level 36, so I think we're actually on par. And I forgot BD has only psychic types. So <laughs> this is gonna be powerful. Um, I was gonna use the hat Pokemon level. Hat. Teeny? It's hat something. And then I realized it was a psychic type and I'll use my old beetle, so. Eh. Ooh! Silver potion. How fancy. You're not gonna live this fight. Actually, you might actually. Yeah, okay, that brings up uh, enough. I'm so used to late game. It avoiding my attack. Oh, I have Hutzel, by the way, so that's gonna be powerful. A powerful Hutzel Darman attack. Okay, okay, maybe maybe not the most powerful Darman. Okay, maybe not. Maybe 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 I'll keep missing all his attacks. Um this is a proper time to go to Runagris. Which I need to rename because I can't say that name. I don't know how to say it. Um, Runrigus. Oh, Runrigus. Um, Sidebeam's just gonna do anything. It's, I think it has the same stats as... Kofurigus? Or well, at least maybe there's like special defense and defense is swapped. Because it's really bulky. Kofurigus is just really bulky Pokemon in general. Ooh, fake test. Lowering my special defense. Okay, well I guess I'm not bulky anymore. I just love how this Pokemon... It's designed. So far, I actually really love um, this one. Um, Kafarigas is a uh, Pokemon that I don't really like, so... Okay, don't really like it's a... Overstatement. It's a Pokemon that I don't mind. I just don't actively be like, oh, I want to use it. This is a Pokemon that I actually probably like to use. I love its design. I don't know why. Okay. McCream is actually getting levels. Drainicus. Ooh, okay. Uh... Please don't tell me this is recording. I think I was off screen. I'm sorry about my mouse. I need to actually disable my mouse from showing up. Tree Kiss, Evasionist. And this is Horde Battles. I, mm, I really want Horde Battles. Also, I learned off screen. Okay, I'm playing through um, a second profile as a female because I actually realized all the bags suck for the male trainer. And that annoys me. So I'm actually going to be on my competitive side on the female. This would be my Shang Hunting because I have like a 330 Pokemon. Uh, the badges. Have the most ununique name ever. Uh, Miles Bass is the Grass Bass. Ness's badge is the Water Badge. I only can believe Cabbage Badge is the Fire Badge. It's actually terrible. Um, oh, Bohan is actually doing something. Wait, Bohan have Strong Jaw? Wait a minute. So that means I should have taught it Thunder Thing. I guess I can reteach it. Yeah. Okay. This is the Pokemon Hatchworm. Okay. Hatchroom was the Pokemon I wanted to add to my team, but I already had uh, Pokemon, so I was like, uh, maybe not. Or oh, I already had a second type, so. My partner move is sp simply spended, wouldn't you say? No. Psybeam. I guess a stab. I don't know why I thought this looked like I had minus special defense. Okay, that was, that was stupid. That was stupid to me, but, uh. I go out to Orbital. Orbital is a bug type. I don't know why this actually looked like a fairy type though. It, to me, it looked like a prime fairy type and not a prime psychic type. I guess it's technically a wizard because the hat and everything. Hat looks like a wizard hat. Maybe psychic fairy would be a good typing. Eh? Eh? Now we already have enough psychic fairies. Like I'm 99% sure um, Glalin Rapidash evolves into Glalin Rapidash evolves into um, Glalin Ponyta. No, Glalin Ponyta evolves into Glalin Rapidash, and that's a fairy type. So. Oh, Psychic Fairy? It has to be. That's the most Psychic Fairy Pokemon I have ever seen. Point out should be Psychic Fairy. But maybe I'm like just... in Piggy, I guess. I have to win this for the chairman. Do you really think I'll let you... I'll let you... Okay, I don't know. Oh, here's a Ponyta. Are you talking about this thing? This thing should definitely be Psychic Fairy. Just want to point that out. It doesn't really look like a Psychic type. It looks like a Fairy type. I'm not 99% sure they made a psychic just to give it to um, BD. If they really wanted a psychic, I'd just put Abra in here. That'd be perfectly fine. He already has two generation 5 Pokemon. Yeah, that's not gonna do anything. I have this Orbital. I have been confused. Hey, I don't hurt myself though. Fantastic. Is that his last Pokemon? He had four. Four for the fourth gym. Hopefully they get up to six by like the sixth or seventh. But knowing Game Freak, they probably don't have six Pokemon ever. Until like post-game battle. 
if they have a post-game battle. You defeated Pokemon Trainer Baby. This has to be some kind of mistake. I demand a do-over. I mean, your Pokemon are healed, so I easily win. I won. Again. No. But why? How can this be? How could someone like you get in my way? I was the one treasured by this chill man. I was the one who was able to defeat, um, defeat the champion. I'm the one of the elect. Someone who can shorter the future of the Galar region. Challenge of BD. Wait a minute. Why does the chill man want the champion to be beaten? Is it just because the champion has been the champion for so long? I wondered what you were up to when you asked about Chillman's versus Kabbalah. I can't believe you tried to use the Chillman's Pokemon to destroy a historical site. D. D. Okay, new favorite character. I, I, I still believe Hop is my favorite character. Yeah, I, 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 um, I know people hate Hop. I know my friend hates Hop. Uh, actually, my friend said he likes Hop at the end of the game. So maybe he gets better. I like Hop. So, <laughs> eh? Who cares about some ancient rune when the next thousand years are at stake? Did you stand in the path of a Pokemon Sipper Beam or something? How do you expect to split the chairman with that sort of thinking? Ah. Also, BD is actually up there. I, I really like BD. So. Yum, BD. If I can say, is it BD? BD? I think it's BD, but that's just a weird name. It pains me to have to say this, but I am truly disappointed. It is true that I am the one who found you back when you were all alone. I saw Talon, you, you reminded me a little bit of myself back when I was young. That's why I sent you to a trainer school to give you a um, chance at success. But trying to destroy a male part of Gala's history, you show no love towards Gala. You are clearly not worthy challenger for the gym challenge. We would decide we'll, uh, what um, we would decide to do with. We do. We, uh, I can't speak. I'm sorry. <laughs> we would decide what to do with you later. For now, you will return to Hammerlock. Ooh, he's getting his endorsement removed. Is this going to be like? He's just gonna be following us around, like just being mad and everything. That's that's his entire thing, because he got his gym challenge of ultimate removed. Actually, probably not, but maybe. You you must be joking, right? You're just calling me from the gy gym challenge? Wait, for real? They actually just did it? Oh wow! But you're the one who endorsed me. There are a hundred different ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Challenge BD, I was taking those switching stars you have gathered. Ah, uh, poor Beauty. I, I, he was mean to Hop, so I don't feel that bad, but... I, I think he's so... I think he's so... I actually do like the character a lot. But... He totally did solve that for me. So stupid. Ah, uh, Sonia, an edge too. A terrible shame, all this. An absolute disaster. I never wish to see us lose challengers for this sort of reason. Yet we do what we must to keep things fair and sportsmanlike. Well, at least they have, like, a sense of... Like, you're doing terrible things. You're doing like probably illegal things. We're gonna remove your endorsement, but a possible other things. You know, doing one of BD's matches. Oh, the announcer said that BD has no family. Oh, that's actually kind of. It's kind of a little bit sad. Apparently, it was Rose who took BD under his ring, so BD was battling for the chairman's sake. Okay, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm sympathizing with him. Sympathizing. You, you know I can't speak. You, you know what I mean. One awful ton of events. I hope the more survived all that. Well, it looked like it has like a lot of dent. Nothing major though. Oh, that maybe not. Maybe, maybe not a lot of dent. BD has done the next levels of things. It is. I don't know why that looks so weird actually. Actually, wow. They actually put a cutscene in the game. Okay, I know those cutscenes, it's just that I don't usually expect this. Like, the only cutscene I can remember is from Sun and Moon, that's actual cutscene like that, was the Necrozma scene. Necrozma scene, yeah. Uh, the Soligalia. No, Necrozma scene, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. I watched the last play of that. That's the only one I can remember. I saw the beginning of the game. I don't know. Now, I brilliant ton of events, but the runes were brought into the light for us to see. Oh, the slumbering world theme. Love this theme. What does this tell us the Galar's legends? A sword and shield? I mean, that's obviously... That's it. This is obviously a Pokemon right there. See that Pokemon right there? Book a sword and shield. Right, more than any hero, those things show, um, those things that appear to be a Pokemon that stand out. Not just that, but those Pokemon appear to be holding a sword and shield as if they were using them. 
imagine. Doesn't Dark Souls has something like that? I know there was some Dark Souls they think. Anything else looks interesting? And, um, anything else looks interesting to you? Uh, there was actually two people. I don't know. I only see. Oh, I see two. Oh, good observation. There were really two heroes, but if that's the case, why well, only one statue at the Badu drop in? Because the Badu, um, the Roselia drop in. That's the other one. And then, and sort of showed two ultra super mega delights. And uh, we will have the uh, Roserade um, drop in. Eh? eh? No. I'm sorry. Well, then any statue of the hero or, or tab, um, tapestry. Tape, tap, tap, tapestry. Can't speak, I'm sorry. These runes made it in truly ancient times sh must show us the real truth. Which means... Shield is a problem. No. This is, this is both tailbot options. Yep, I was thinking the same thing. No, 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 this is tailbot. Seems like we're both, um... Seems like at some point in history, the sword and shield will combine with two actual Pokemon. Not two, but one. And that Pokemon is AG stats. And I treated it as the same thing. But then what? They just feed it from history? I honestly think, well, like this picture does not show any of that. It's, it shows that a uh, dog is holding a shield in its mouth and a sword in its mouth. They're not, they're not combined with the Pokemon. Not yet. Dun, dun, dun. Two young heroes, the sword and shield with actually Pokemon, but why would the truth of these runes be hidden when the stories were depicted in artwork? Because you have to be cryptic about stuff. With your help, I feel like we real. I really feel like we made a big discovery here. Thanks, I'll give you a couple of these so you keep getting your best in the gym challenge too. I guess you'll be handing it to Baluna, Balunia, Balunia. Yeah, there we go. Nest, right? Two revives. I'll be selling those. Thank you. Actually, I keep those because I actually die a lot. So there's actually history covered up by the oversized, um, overstylized artwork. I'm gonna have to look into this some more. I feel it was more artistic before it got destroyed. Uh, our, our different artists have different visions. This is a beautiful vision of um, BD. What was this? The hero is actually two people and, and Pokemon? I love how there's no pure, like the pure for Pokemon is Pokemon. I say Pokemons. So, it, it, I, I don't use it properly. It just seems real. So maybe that's why. That young lady, Sonia. Um, she's researching the truth about the runes, right? Could you be the granddaughter of Professor Magnolia? Nope, absolutely not. Don't know where you got that item. I like that. I especially like that old cutscene. It, it, it was just a little something to put in the middle of the game that wasn't much, but I like it. Also, I don't think they hear my Pokemon. People said that this game is so easy. And this game, oh, they heal you so much, but that's why it was so easy. I'm over here like... Did they heal me? No. They don't heal you nearly as much. I also feel like this game is sort of hard. It's just a little bit harder than usual. So the moon I went through with ease. Even the totems that people got like stuck on, um, I was able to go with almost ease. The low entrance is pretty tough in Sun and Moon, but um, even with that, I was able to defeat it pretty easily. Hello? My controller just con disconnected. It disconnected and ran into that corner. I need, no, I need new joy cons. Like I'm being completely honest, my joy cons have like just are dying. No drift. Actually, I have a little drift on my this one right here. But uh, it's nothing major. And the controller just disconnect doesn't connect all the time. It's really weird. Like even with the on the side of the control uh, on the side of the switch. Just really weird, I need to get new Joy Con. But let's enter the force. All I did we and went to this force once because I wanted to see if I could continue to catch Pokemon, but Can I get that? Can I get an impotent? Nope. Wait, what? Is that how I got an impotent? Impotent? Um I don't know how many stages this has. I think it has that at least two. Uh, I'm gonna run away. I can come back and catch a Pokemon. We've already seen this Pokemon in the trails. I love how that actor, like, Impotent never existed. Like, if you even go on the official, like, website, there's nothing about Impotent on it. So it's, like, existed. They've shown it before. Definitely shown it. Uh, but it just doesn't exist. 
Okay, I really like this. Okay, Team Yo's gone. I'm gonna be touching all of these, I, I wanna be honest. Like, nothing's stopping me. Full heal? Fantastic. I know this is probably useless, but... Hey, I got a big group. Fantastic. Oh, there's some trainers down there. This is a double battle. Am I prepared for a double battle? I guess I am. I want to see what's in the grass. I'm just curious. Oh, it's pretty. You gotta be kidding me. Well, it makes sense for Spritzy to be in the morning, but... I kind of said that um, Swirlet is a sword exclusive. I'm assuming so. I believe it's that way in X and Y. That's just, uh... No. I can just bypass them. I got an HM. Fantastic. Snore. I feel like I skipped some things. Huh. Well, just just get into a battle, I guess. The railway the railways are amazing. They can carry a lot um loads. I was gonna say, but I guess that makes sense. Carry loads of Pokemon and people at once. It makes sort of sense. I came to ride a Gala train. I wonder if meeting you would change my life. We have Darling Couple, Robot, and Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Nine Tails and Arcanine. Nine Tails and Colia. There we go. Close enough. Um, I just realized that one of my Pokemon is uh, actually both of my Pokemon are in severe, severe, severe danger right now. I want to bite and help I outspeed you, and I'm going to light screen right now and help I outspeed the Nine Tail. I do not have to see, but they hit both of us. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, so my light screen. Okay, we should be fine. Yeah, we should be fine. I like Obito. It's just really good Pokemon. And this uh, mom, this army voice hits both of us. Split damage between both of us. Fantastic, fantastic. Um, okay, since I don't outspeed, I'm just going to, you know, try to kill this nine tails immediately because it is actually a threat. Oh, quick attack! I'm dead. With this army voice, I'm 99% sure I'm dead. Unless, now this is no chance. Oh, the animation slows down. I'm gonna put. A uh, was it a wide lens? Yeah. A little bit of a mistake on my part. Uh, I guess I can go to... We need to guess. I only got to make creamy, but... Until I evolve it. Which I might actually put on the end of this video. I don't know. I want to record multiple episodes, but like I said, it gets hot in my bedroom because of all the lights I have. It's like... Actually, I have like four lights going on. But it's kind of a lot, a decent amount, so it provides enough heat. And my computer sounds like it's dying. Like, I just realized this is that I'm gonna have to get some new fans or anything, because it's loud. It's not super loud, but it's like loud. Well, it doesn't bother me right now, but I feel like when I'm recording, maybe you can hear it. I know right now, you actually, with a good fan filter, or fan filter, noise gate, it can, like, not be that noticeable, but. Like right now, I don't have a, I have a noise gate on, so when I like stop talking, it's like mute the microphone pretty much, and then when I stop talking, it picks it up again. It's pretty nice, so there's no background noise or anything. But I feel like maybe maybe it has to do some new computer fans because my computer gets hot. Like right now, I'm sorry about that by the way. Uh, it's actually not hot. It's around 60 percent, but I'm only at like 30 percent load, so. Uh, 50% actually load. Not bad, not bad. Actually, not bad. Actually, really not bad, but... I'm really on the live sitting right now. Because I really can't push my computer that much. Also, he looks like a Team Flill. Grunt. Don't know why, like... Don't know why he just feels like, um, he seems like it. Um, a good way to forget about the trouble of this loss would be able to ride the train. Or to ride the train. Too strong. I guess I'll be looking for someone I can actually beat. Nothing. Nope. Can't turn this on? I love this. I, I don't know why. Um, I guess I can come back off screen and... Well, going for off screen. I don't know if I'm going the proper way. Obviously going the proper way, I guess. I think I already reached Bologna. Ballonlia. Yeah, Bologna. 
Bungalow? I can't speak. Uh, Fury type gem, I believe. Um, I remember the Lurico said something about this. So, I really like how this looks. I'll just look more. Nothing over here. I really like how this looks. Okay, so. Oh, this, this, um, hatch rim on top of this Pokemon Center. And this is, um, a Chinchou. Oh, this is fantastic. I can't wait to explore the city. This is my, this, this so far actually looks fantastic. I, I don't want to say this is my favorite looking city so far. It's my favorite looking city so far. Um, I might go back off screen, maybe, and go battle. What's my levels right now? I need to be like level 50 to catch Pokemon in the wild area right now. Probably Hyle, so. I can catch up to level 40. Oh, because I didn't get any batch today. Oops, low IQ. But yeah, that's it for today's episode of the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Show. Let's play, uh, today's episode we actually did a decent amount. Uh, we did the more thing. I didn't it. Took a little bit longer, but I did commentate it all. Uh, we made it through the forest. The forest didn't take it long, and I feel like I gotta go back though. There's gonna be things to find. I don't know if I'm gonna do like a little side episode, a little bonus episode with like half my lights off so it doesn't get so hot in here. And just like put it as a bonus. I don't know. Uh. Yeah, that's it. If you enjoyed today's episode of the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Show, let's play with your least favorite video or press the like button. I know I repeat myself a lot, but you have to repeat yourself. Actually, you don't have to. I just got into the habit of doing it. Um, press the like button. If you dislike it though, press the dislike button. If you made it the video, well, you have to like my content enough to probably subscribe. You'll be notified when I upload. If you press the bell, then press you want to be notified from this channel, and then press are you sure, and then you'll be notified because one step's not enough, two steps, also not enough, three steps, maybe. Press OK, please. And yeah, goodbye. Hope you have a good day, night, morning, or whatever it's for you, and goodbye. Yes, I said goodbye multiple times. I keep saying goodbye, because goodbye, and goodbye.